Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel where we try to seek the good. I hope all of you are having a nice day. And today I'm going to tell you guys about the uh, several good things that happened um, in my day today. I don't think I uh, have any spe specific number, it's just a lot really happened today. And I guess to really start things off, the first good thing that happened was uh, most of the doctors in the clinic are actually on vacation this week and several more are going to be on vacation for the rest of the month. So this upcoming month is going to be a bit slower, a bit more relaxed than usual. And that was pretty evident in today's clinic where my doctor is one of those doctors on vacation. And I worked with another doctor that I'm usually uh, pretty closely associated with, but only work with them about once, maybe twice a week. And we had a pretty good clinic day, but there was also a period where instead of having the usual hour lunch break, uh, there was a three hour gap between a 10.30 patient and a 1.30 patient. And I was able to get plenty of work done then and even listen to one episode of my horror podcast, which was good. Uh, a bit sad for my liking, but still pretty good. And uh, yeah, I just appreciate the new change of pace for things. So we've got some good things going on there. Uh, that doctor, by the way, that I was um, working with today, I'm going to be working with him again on Thursday. But after that, he's also going on vacation uh, to Greece, according to him. So uh, very jealous and I wish him best of luck. I'll, I'll save more about that for uh, Thursday after I finish working with him. But good things there. Uh, some more some more good things uh, whenever I got home um, Found out that my brother-in-law has made his own YouTube channel now in addition to his Spotify channel um, Let's see it was called his Spotify channel is called don't read into it And um, I forget what his YouTube channel's name is I'm going to put the uh, link for it down in the uh, Description below so you guys can check it out if you want but right now. He has two um, videos one about is kind of analysis of the history of the Texas Rangers um, and the Major League Baseball and uh, why you should be a fan of them now. And the other video is an, an analysis of sand and uh, certain college stadiums, which is uh, pretty funny because that um, that video was actually born from a tweet where he uh, put a typo where he said sand instead of hand. And um, when uh, he went to correct his typo we found out a lot of his uh, co-workers friends and followers on twitter had uh, jumped on board to uh wanting to get a sand analysis so he went ahead and made that video pretty entertaining pretty funny so uh you guys can check it out if you want i uh, make sure to go ahead and subscribe for um, myself so i can keep up with his new videos and uh, go ahead and give them a like so i can support him and encourage him to make some more because he's a really good content maker and uh, i hope you guys will find him similarly um entertaining so uh, good things there and um lastly one of the um uh, last good things that i got to do was um i got to make dinner for the first time in a good while and i specifically made uh, some mac and cheese but I kind of messed around with it. I kind of had the, uh, um, it's not exactly the Velveeta package of uh, shells and cheese to work with. It was more of a uh, store brand that I um, used because honestly we find the store brand to be better than the Velveeta brand. That's just us. But um, was making some of that and I added some sriracha. I added some mozzarella to make it a bit more gooier. Um, added some basil, added some black pepper, um, and I don't think I added anything else. Oh, and I also added some bacon bits, and it turned out to be pretty good. Uh, one of my better mac and cheese batches that I've done, especially recently. So I'm going to need to remember that little combination if I want to try recreating and improving on it in the future. So good things there. My wife enjoyed it and uh, got herself another plate, which she usually doesn't get uh, more than one plate. So I was very flattered about that. And yeah, I, I just made a good um, a good bowl of mac and cheese and that was another good thing that happened. And that will actually do it for the video today. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you had any good things that happened in your day, please feel free to share it down in the comments below so we can continue to share the good things that happen all around us. And if you don't feel comfortable with that, that's okay. I hope you'll consider taking something positive away from these videos to make your day just a little bit better. Also, if you like the video, sorry, bubble. Um, if you like the video or liking the content on the channel, I hope you'll consider liking, subscribing, just so we can keep up with future good things that happen in general. 
And with all that being said, thank you guys once again for watching. I hope you continue to have a nice day. And this has been Seek the Good. Goodbye.